Hello everyone, welcome to Knowledge Circle. In today's video, we will learn how to make EMI calculator program in Java. As you can see, the formula of EMI calculation is already given. Okay, accordingly, we will make the program. So let's start the video. Let's go to BlueJ interface. Now we'll create a class with the name EMI. After the creation of class, we'll double click the class. Now we will begin the code. Import java.util.scanner then we will write the class name emi we'll begin the scope of the class and then we will write public static void main the main function then after we will begin the scope of the main function then we'll write scanner ob new scanner system dot in it means we will create the object of scanner class so that we can take input from user now we have to see that how many variables are required here we'll take p for loan amount and r for rate of interest and n for number of years okay here we will see uh, take uh, r will be taken as uh, the in rate of interest per annum that we will accept and then we will convert that rate of interest monthly okay so four variables we have declared here p r n e e for uh, storing the value of emi so we'll provide a message here uh, using system dot out dot println enter the loan amount okay so that loan amount will be stored in the variable p so p equal to ob dot next double okay in the same way we will uh, do for the remaining two now we will copy and paste the code and we'll make changes to that code okay now uh, we'll change the message enter the loan amount which is written we'll write there enter the rate of interest and the rate of interest entered by the user will be stored in the variable r and the third message will be enter the time in years so that we are going to do and here we'll write r and here let's change the message enter the time in years okay and the time given by the user will be stored in the variable n now here a very important thing is that what we have to do is because the user has entered the time in years and because we have to calculate the emi so that's why we will multiply uh, we will update the value of n we will multiply by 12 here rate of interest is given per annum so we'll convert by dividing 12 into it will be converted to month and again we will divide by 100 okay because it is uh, rate of interest is in percentage so that's why we have divided by 100 now we are going to calculate emi so the formula which has already been shown in the beginning that formula we will use uh, that is loan amount rate of interest and then it will be 1 plus r power n so so we will use here math.pow method so 1 plus r will be base and power that is uh, the power will be the second argument of this method and uh, with it with this we finish it and uh, now we'll divide it what we will divide this uh, math.pow 1 plus r power n so i'll just copy the same uh, formula and i will paste here okay at last we have to put minus one also so i'll put minus one and i'll put the braces properly so that there should not be any syntactical error and uh, let's put the semicolon so this is the formula for emi calculation and uh, i'll just copy a printing statement from here and i'll paste it here and make it updated okay so here we'll write just emi and equal to concatenation we'll close the uh, inverted comma concatenation and the variable storing emi is e we'll close main and class now it's time for uh, checking and the program is successfully compiled let's uh, run the program now we are going to give an amount i am giving here 10000 rate of interest i have given here 10 percent okay and the time i have given two years you can see the emi is 461 rupees 